Hi, the setup you see in front of you is for running a stepper motor without a driving circuit. Now I know that you might have seen a few videos on YouTube with a similar title, but this video is completely different. Firstly, I am not going to use any capacitor. Secondly, I am not going to use home socket power supply. And thirdly, I am going to run it in both clockwise and anti-clockwise directions under its full efficiency which means that the output torque of this stepper motor will be revealed at the end of this video. So guys what you see here is a 6 wire stepper motor and a 3 phase AC generator. So it has a crank attached so that I can rotate it according to my requirements. And I have attached uh, this generator to this vice which is being held to this wooden board. So since it's a three phase generator it has three wires and it has six wires and each having different colors. Now watch closely to understand the connections of a three phase supply to a six wire stepper motor. So first what you are going to do is take the black and the white wire and connect them together. Okay. The black and the white wires are connected. Now we are left with four wires. The pink, the yellow and these two colored wires. Now these four wires will be connected to the three phase supply of this generator. So now I am going to do the connection. So the first wire. Okay. First wire I am going to connect like this. Okay. Now the second wire will be connected like this. and now I am left with just one wire and here we have two wires left so what I am going to do is I am going to try the pink one first and let's hope that it works fine and if it does not work then I am going to switch to the yellow one I am going to rotate the crank and you should see the stepper motor operate like a normal motor okay go so you can see that it is running in one direction just like any other motor at a really low RPM so this was the successful operation of the stepper motor in clockwise direction now for the anti-clockwise connection you can see that these two same colored wires are connected to the supply from this three phase generator I'm going I'm just going to disconnect one of the supplies Okay, so I have connect, disconnected uh, one of the supplies and I am going to connect it to the yellow wire. And you will see that will uh, start rotating in the anti-clockwise direction. Now you can see that it has started operating in the anti-clockwise direction. Okay. So this is how a three phase supply will be connected to a stepper motor with a six wire system. Okay, now the torque estimation. So guys uh, what I have done is I have extended the shaft of this stepper motor and I have placed an additional bearing on this vise 
to support the shaft because when I'm using it under high torque conditions, uh, then this bearing or a bush, whatever it is on the stepper motor that is holding the shaft that might get damaged. So to protect that, I've gone through all this. So guys, uh, this is an almost 2 kg inertia disc that is used in uh, trade mill motors. So uh, let me measure it first on the weighing scale. So yeah, as you can see this uh, flashing 1942 grams which is 2 kgs. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to connect this disc to this shaft and let's see if, if it can uh, rotate it. Okay. So I have successfully connected the inertia disc, uh, even though it is still a bit wavy, but still it will do the job. Okay, so now what I have to do is connect the generator uh, to the six wires of the stepper motor. So guys, uh, everything is now perfectly connected. So I'm going to rotate the shaft and you should see this stepper motor rotating this 2 kg's inertia disc. Okay. So let's get on with it. So you can see that the stepper motor is operating the inertia disc easily. And this indicates that it has a really high torque. And I believe that uh, even if the weight of the disc had been 5 kgs or 7 kgs, it would still have successfully rotated it. So, okay. so guys, that was all about the video. Thank you so much for watching it. Please hit like and don't forget to share and subscribe.